Hello and welcome to the Daily Gas for November 19th, 2024, called This One Is Actually Position Sudoku This Time, I Swear, by Bill Murphy. Normal Sudoku rules apply. Clues outside the grid give the position of the highest digit in the first three cells from the direction of the clue. So, what does that mean? Well, Bill actually gives us an example. The two in column two here means that the highest digit in the first three cells in column two is in row two column two. All right, the two in column eight here means that the highest digit in those three cells here is in row eight column eight. It's always from the direction of the clue. So here, this, the third cell in this group of three would be the highest digit. In this case, the third cell in this group of three would be the highest digit. And that's it. Those are the rules. Let's just jump right into it. All right, so right off the bat here, this being the highest digit, three, means this is a one, two pair. And actually we have a one, two over here and almost exactly, actually it is like perfect symmetry almost. Three, eight, three, eight. So yeah, so six being, and we actually can place stuff here. This being one, two, we now have a three, one, two, three, one, two, right? Then the next part of this is, is what's going on with this set or this set? Well, six being the highest digit in the set means it must be four and five to finish it off there, which means this is seven, eight, nine. This is seven, eight, nine, which nine is the highest digit in the set. So in both cases, it goes in the second slot. Oh, and somehow I've completely missed seven, eight and seven, eight here because of the eight. eight and that do, does something as well, right? Eight. This tells us that the third slot in either direction from here is the highest digit. Well, we already have an eight, which means the only digit that is higher than eight is in fact nine. So we don't have a roping. That's something to consider. <clears throat> Ones, actually with the one, places one here. Hmm. All right. Sorry, let me let me not get distracted. Seven is the highest digit here. Something is the highest digit here. Something is the highest digit here. What are we messing with? What are the digits? So, ah, where does just seven go? That's easy. And then eight and two. How could... Oh, wow. Sorry, that's just easy. Basic Sudoku one in this column goes here. And also we could think of that as a one, two pair staring up. Then... One, one, two, and something. One, two, six. Hmm. This is four, three, or two. Actually, we know four goes here, so it's either four, three, or four, two. Hmm. Two, oh, two, oh, and one. Sorry, I've completely missed that. This is one, two, and one gives us two, one. Then two goes here, one goes here, two. Hmm. <laughs> seven. Ah, seven in this column goes here. What are we still missing? Uh, eight and something. Eight and two. Eight is the highest digit here. This is the highest digit in the set. Could very well be nine. Hmm. One, two, six. We're also missing one, two, six here. All right. Four, somewhere here. If four is the highest digit, then that would force one here. And we actually know that, the, oh, well, sorry, that's the easy, that's the easy thing. Can, so where does one go in this box? Well, one can't go here. One can't 
go here because if it did then one would be the highest digit which you know is not true this can't be one so this is just simply one this is two six what are we missing here six five four okay six here this must be five four in that order uh, this must be four then from the column we need three three gives us three four five six nine six nine this is actually also five six nine eight says this can't be nine but it could be five or six <laughs> One, two, six. Two, four, five, six. Hmm. Five. Could go here, or could go here. I feel like it was very smooth up until this point. Nine. Okay, wait. What can this be? Can't be nine, eight, seven, six. Five, four, or two. If it was four, this would have to be two, and that's not allowed, which means it must be five, and this must be four, because the minimum this can be here is four. So kind of a weird way to get that but it works seven by sudoku goes here six and two two six ah wait two gives us one six here and this is two six not particularly helpful five ah wait we know four has to be one of these two digits so now two or three it must be two to resolve this across we need actually probably this is better yeah, 3 and 8. And I guess that place is 9, though, because this can't be 9, because then this wouldn't be the highest digit. That means this is 7. And then 6 and 1. Oh, wait, wait, sorry, we knew that. 1, 6, and this is 2, 6. So what can we do here, then? This is 3, three 5, 8. 3, 5, 8. So 5 or 8. If this is 5, this would have to be 1. If this is 8, actually, does this always have to be 1 just by just basic Sudoku? It can't be 2, can't be 3, can't be 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Yeah, th literally, this is just a naked, uh, uh, a naked digit here. That gives us 1, 6. It doesn't set the order of the 6, but... Sorry, somehow still 569 is not... Oh, wait, 4. 4. Oh, wait, now, wait, really? That's weird. 569, 569, across 569. What are we missing here? 569 and 2. Aha, this is 2. 569 and what here? 8. 8 can actually go in either one. 569, 8. 69, 5, 8. But where does 3 go? This is simply 3. And 8 gives us 8, 5. All right. 8, 5. 8 gives us 8. Then 5, 6, 9. This is 5. 6, 9. Ooh, what in the world? 6, 9, 5. Something here is going to set the order. So what is it? Ah. Uh, Because, yeah, any of 5, 6, or 9 is valid to solve this, but 9 isn't valid here. So this is a 6, 9 pair across, which places 5 here, which places 5 here. And then 6 and something, 6, 2, 2, 6. All right, let's finish this off first, though. 9 and 7, so this is 9, 7, like this. And now 6, 9, 9, 9, and then 6s go here, and we broke something. Gosh darn it twos, threes, almost a nice uh, pattern there, fours, fives, 
six is. Wait. This can't be nine. Wait, did I did I mix those up right at the end there? What in the world? This must be six nine like this, but nine would leave us with six here. <sighs> Where do we break, folks? Where did we break? It's the only thing left. Five. Oh wait, I said this was a six nine pair. This is six five, that's why. Six or five goes here. All right, let's continue. Two six, this is my fault. I tried to jump ahead of things when I really shouldn't have been. Nine seven, and now a nine gives us six nine, but the six, so here's the thing here. This can't be nine, it must be five. That's how we set the order. This is five, and then now, now we have the nines here and the sixes here, and we are done. In 10 minutes and 18 seconds, with this one is actually position Sudoku this time, I swear, by Bill Murphy. A little bit of, uh, had to play a little bit of catch up there at the end because uh, we, we did something with our brain on this one, but it all worked out in the end. So, hopefully you enjoyed, and... Thank you for watching.